You people are some lucky ducks. I managed to get my save file back. It just took me a week. Okay, hey everyone, what about here? And welcome back to Feel the Snow. Oh, it's dark out. Of course it's dark out. Uh, what does that mean we do? Pretty much nothing. Uh, we wait. Let's let's do inventory management. So I've got, like, wool and ice cala and ice cala seeds. Okay. Well, let's deal with things for a second. Don't know what to do with the wool for the time being. I've got two shields. I need another sword. I have sticks. Okay, so let's let's make some let's make some more weaponry for a, a short period of time. Uh, mainly because we're gonna be we're gonna be fighting things. I can guarantee it. Okay, so we got that taken care of. Uh, I've only got two stones left, but we got a uh, sword, a backup sword. I guess the last thing we want to do is we want to make a uh, a pickaxe, which we can make on the fly. Guess I should have just done that instead. Okay, so yeah, I've got these ice callas, which I don't need. I've got a number of healing potions, which might be a little bit excessive. I got a bunch of roasted swedes, and I think we're in a fine spot. And we've got the rune of teleportation, so I can pop that open where wherever, whenever. Is there anything else I need to make? Nope. Okay, perfect. Unfortunately, we gotta walk the long way, because I don't have a I don't have a portal to work with. Oh, right. This reminds me. Let's use the ice callus seeds for a second. Uh, see, I'm not gonna mess with the roasted swedes for the time being. We've got more than enough food. Well, no, maybe, maybe I will. Anyway, uh, let's talk about the elephant in the room. Uh, why did this series go on a week-long hiatus? Um, my computer died. Uh, like, blue screen of death and never came back, kind of died. Ah, okay, we don't want to do any more of this. Um, but yeah, so my computer was completely non-functional. Uh, which was kind of an awful nightmare, uh, situation. Okay, good. We do have those. We've got this. Alright, let's get back in here. Let's just open up this chest. And let's keep going. I don't, I don't want to spend too much time here because it's a long trek. And I don't want to have to wait. Luckily, we do have the ability to teleport and some other things. Okay, um, but yeah, so my computer blue screened of death. And then I, I couldn't, I couldn't do anything. I had to wait for my computer to reformat, so on and so forth. That was a nightmare. That was not a fun nightmare to have to deal with at all. And then, um, then I got lucky. Uh, so usually when you blue screen of death, it actually takes out like your, uh, it, it usually actually even takes out your, your setup, your save files. And this game specifically does not have uh, Steam Cloud support. So even if I wanted to, I was pretty much out of luck as far as uh, getting this one to go. But I managed to like, it took a while. I had to go into like my old Windows file, find all my app data, stuff like that. It really, I, I managed to get my save file over uh, where I normally would have lost it, which was definitely helpful. Um, but then extra life happened and everything else happened and I just hadn't had, I just didn't have time. I would have been recording right as rain normally, but you lose your computer and certain series just go. And there's not much you can do about those things, sadly. Luckily, uh, we made it out alright. Oh, right. What is the, what's the quest? Journal. Wool for five units of wool. Oh, that's why we had those wolves. was wondering about that. Okay. Well, we'll fight some wolves. We'll fight... We'll do many things here. But I'm just gonna keep sprinting across the world. God. Damn, I wish I had... Oh, right, I died. You know what I'm gonna do? As soon as we make it to the place we're going to go, I'm just gonna pop open a, a portal here. That seems like the wisest possible choice I have. I'm also just trying to look at, at what abilities I have here. Because we got Concussion Blow, then there's Wind Blade, and then there's Coming Soon. Honestly, it might not be a bad idea to start putting points into uh, Arrow Mastery. Or Traps, I don't know. That's, that's a bit of a hard one. Because if I could do Arrow Mastery or Traps... Uh, you know, good dabble into both that could work for me might also be a good idea to oh mana regeneration 
Yeah, it might not be a bad idea to put points into that, too. Well. Let's pop open a portal. It's got five minutes. On that cooldown. But this way I can go to and from if need be. And if I do die, I should be able to warp back. I think. Okay. What was that? Okay. Looks like I can kind of spam attack him, though. That works. Let's heal. It would be nice if there's like a... I really wish the skill tree was like much deeper. I wish the skill tree was much deeper than it is. Because, like, I would very much love to have, like... What am I thinking? Just a whole host of, of different moves that I could use. Uh, like, you know, I've been playing a lot of Skyrim lately, and it would be really neat if there's like, a healing spell that I could use. But obviously not. I'm also really surprised I'm not getting recipes from these suckers. Well, as long as I don't have to fight two of them at once, I should be okay. Alright, there's another one. It's like he's pre-programmed to... Okay, there we go. If you time it right, you can get him with a stun. Okay, that's three, four pieces of wool. Let's let's see if I can get the... Let's see if I can get all of them. Okay. Well, I thought I heard something going... Uh, uh, oh, yep, there's one. Okay. I'm not close enough. Okay, drop that guard. There we go. Yeah, if I just cheese it, if I just cheese him as hard as I can, works out for me, and we level up. Okay. Uh, I don't know what increasing concussion blow does. We could go ma magic resist. I could do shield mastery. Let's do. Let's put points into this for the time being. Bump that. Oh, right. I gotta hit it multiple times to get the actual thing. Okay, and then we've got. Okay, there we go. There's supposedly the last one. Yep, last piece of wool. Okay, so everything's looking good. Oh, good to know. The hat... Um... The hat does not decay. That's actually super helpful. It also weirds me out in this game that it's always so dim. Like, it's, it's dark at nighttime, it's dark at daytime. Okay, can I not? Okay, it's being stunlocked by that helpful fairy, though. I'll take that instead. Okay. Yeah, so we've got to watch out for the ice shooters, but as long as I've got this, this helping fairy to stunlock things for me, I don't have much to worry about. So we'll leave this alone. We want to go find this guy. Worst comes to worst, I hang out at his place for the day. Ah, the wool, much obliged, little one. Now listen closely. The path ahead is far more dangerous than you realize. You want your friend's icy hearts back, aye? The creatures have been taking him. Not sure what for, but I can't be. it can't be good. I mean, take the ice cream. Uh, Gnainus. For centuries, this cave has been under her protection. But even she couldn't resist the call to darkness. She shut herself away in her chamber, and you need to get to her. But how? Hmm. It's a long shot, but there's a shaman who once talked nonsense, saying he found a secret path into her chambers. But no one believed him. He's the kind to make up stories, you see. Still, if you want to ask him, go wandering through the cave. He'll likely be gathering mushrooms. Okay, so we got a recipe for an iron ingot. Hey, nice. Okay, we need those, presumably. We do need to make a furnace, though, and I don't think we have that. Yeah, we've got a garden bed, a teleport stone, stone stuff, but none of that. This music in here is great. All right. I want to go looking for... Iron and stuff. 
this this fairy thing. Yeah, I want to go looking for iron and other things, but I'm not sure how lucky we are, uh, how easy that's going to be. I guess this is iron right here, now that I'm looking at it. Yep, that's it. Okay, but yeah, the problem still remains. We're going to have to go out of our way for it. I guess I can get some more stone from this. Yeah, okay. I don't want to venture too far because it immediately gets really dark out. What the? Oh, come on. Okay. So it's nighttime, which hurts. I wonder if those shadow creatures show up as long as I'm hanging out in this guy's light radius. It's an interesting question. Okay, we do have snail meat. We have the thing for iron armor, but yeah, we need that we need that furnace. Oh. I hate opening and closing doors in this game. Okay, so we gotta find a shaman. He's gotta be somewhere around there. Uh we can make iron armor, but we need an anvil. This game is goofy. Okay, what do we do we have? We do have mushrooms. Got a little bit of wood. Move the iron ore for the time being. I'll just eat the ice rose, even though it's not super useful, and I'll move this over here. Okay. Seeing as we're going to be taking a bunch of damage, we might as well make use of these. Okay, so we want to do fire, fire. Okay, there we go. Oh, health regeneration. Huh, good to know. I didn't realize my HP would come back near a fireplace. I'll keep that under advisement for the future. Uh, let's get as many of these uh, mar marshmallows cooked as possible. We're going to be going back the next day. As long as that portal's still there. I mean, it could just go now. We've still got plenty of food. And we'll have more. Yeah, let's just go back. There's no, there's no management I want to do here anyway. And worst comes to worst, I hang out and things come to attack me. We do need to put some more points into Shield Mastery, though. If those if those snails can break uh, break through my block, then I don't want to I don't want to deal with it. There's a lot of gross ass noises going on outside, though, so I'm not super happy about. I wonder if I can put a teleport stone inside my house. I don't think I could put it inside my house. Could work. Don't know. Well, it's almost it's almost daytime. It's still going to be like super impossible to see or hear anything. Okay. Well, I guess I'm just gonna I guess I'm just gonna kill time. This is gonna be a short episode today, sadly. I'm just gonna I'm just gonna go find a little bit of iron, go from there. I assume he doesn't have anything to say. Yep. Okay. Well, if we check the map, it looks like our quest is further over to the right. Okay. Guess we're sticking around in here for the time being. What the? Do not. Okay, got him. I'm on the cusp of death. Which would be a problem. But we're okay. Okay, so we've got our furnace, which is nice. Now let's just cram our face full of these marshmallows. I swear I hit him. But not. Like, this game is too high stakes for how awkward it is. It's like if RuneScape required you to dodge. That'd be impossible. And yet, yeah, I, I'd say I'd put this in the exact same situation as that. It's like, I can see where they're going with it. But at the same time, it's like, you can die from almost anything. These guys, like, if they hit me normally, they take off a third of my health. And to be fair, I need more recipes so I can... I need more recipes so I can actually get the proper equipment, and I'm supposed to use and abuse my block. But, like, if I don't, I'm ultra screwed. Okay, there we go. There's the next one. And I should probably invest in some magic regeneration at some point here. 
just because. Okay. So we're gonna... Oh, right. Anvil, sword. Okay, so perfect. So if I do this, we can start getting some iron. As long as I don't get attacked, we should be okay. There's no guarantee that that's gonna happen. But yeah, if I can... Um, if I can make a, a full set of iron, we should be able to not have to worry about things here. What's that? A mushroom. Just restores my hunger by five. That's useful enough. Yeah, like, everything except for the combat in this game feels great. Uh-oh. Because, you know, you can... I, I really like the gear gear system, even if it's a little bit basic and repetitive. I like the recipe system, even if I do wish it followed more of the, either the Kriya style or the uh, Dragon Quest Builder style, where you find the thing and then it's like, you have, congratulations, you figured out how to do X, and it's like, yes. Uh, just because that would allow for a little bit more uh, smoother of an experience, I think. But at the same time, I don't know, I've, I really have seen worse situations. Okay, let's keep gathering stone and stuff. I'm gonna want to make a full suit of iron. Such a loud noise. We've also got all this snail meat. Ow. Um. Yeah, I'm just gonna pop that there. Okay, we need, we need my weapons. Okay, there we go. Because, like, either I have to cheese my enemies or whatever. Like, I guess, really, if just the, the wizardy mage dudes... If I could block and move. That could work. Okay, this is going to get real dangerous. You know what? Let's just, get a, let's just go around them. Now let's keep gathering this iron. Okay, we got the recipe for the iron shield now. That's the other thing I could start doing... No, we'll do we'll do lollipop gathering later. I wouldn't mind doing lollipop gathering earlier, but um, that'll be an issue uh, if my inventory gets too full here. And it just did. I mean, we've got like ice. Question is, can I can I mine these? No, I can't. Okay. Let's go pugilism some snails. The snails are the easy ones to fight. The ice guys die faster, but the snails, as long as they don't hit me with their charge, are pretty much uh, vulnerable to everything. I might actually... Crap. I thought I stunned them, but no, it's a, you can't fit stuns into your standard maneuvers. Okay, I want to test something. So I can't get ice out of these. Okay, that's cool. Honestly, I'm probably still going to waste my time focused on, um... I'm gonna waste my time focused on, uh, getting ice from elsewhere. Seeing as, uh... You know, getting getting ice from here is dangerous. There's a lot of enemies. There's also iron and some other things. Okay, we're leaving. This is going to suck real bad if we let it continue. Okay. Ah. He, they fire so fast, too. Like, he could force shot me. He could. It would be really easy, too. Okay, you know what? I've got enough. Let's... Uh, I can't grab my shovel. Let's just eat the lollipop and let's get out of here. Okay, yeah, I'd, I'd love to stick around, but we need to make that furnace. Honestly, we need to do several things here, including make my house bigger. So let's... Let's eat some of these things. And... Let's figure out... Oh, right. I was gonna cook the snail meat. Because we need to... We need we need to make iron, obviously. We've got all these roasted swedes, too. 
but it looks like if I keep killing snails, it's gonna work out just as well. Okay, uh, so we got this taken care of. Let's let's grab the lumber that we've collected, because I got a ton of it. Let's grab the singular wooden wall. And we're gonna wanna make two things of floor. Two wooden floors and some indeterminate amount of walls that's more than that. Okay. Yeah, unfortunately, my house is starting to become uh, too cramped for my needs. Oh, right. I've got a... I gotta shovel this up. Okay, my inventory is full. Well, that's okay. Problem solved. You know, actually, if I can get a hammer or an axe, this will work. Okay, let's move the wood over for a second. It's, it, or not an axe, a saw. Okay, seven. Floors and roofs, oh. Okay, so I guess we need a hammer for this. Yeah, what I'm probably going to do at some point is, um, move, move all of my gardens from behind the house, uh, over to the sides, but we're going to have to wait on that. I just want to get this set up before we, before we get attacked too much. Let's see, there we go. Do I have enough? I'm gonna be just shy of. I'm gonna need two more walls. Okay, well, we'll get behind this. It'd be nice if I could get like a, I don't know, a wooden, like a glass ceiling. Seems kind of weird to say it that way, but still, be helpful. Okay, perfect timing, except for we've got to switch the doors around. Okay, cool. Uh, so let's do six. Get the chest. Did I get the chest? I didn't get the chest. Well, at least I can reach this chest now, which has utter garbage in it. Let's move the goblin skin over. Let's move the spare sword over. The problem is we have all this stuff that we no longer need. Which is an issue. Okay, we've got all these spare Swedes, which really don't help that much, because I've got snail meat that I can farm. Okay, let's let's move these goblin skins over it at the very least. Same thing with the torn cloth. Yeah, because as long as we're eating those snails for their meat, we're fed forever. So I'm just gonna get ultra fat here. Okay, now let's let's figure out about making this furnace. Furnace requires a lot of things. Okay, what about the anvil? Three iron ingots. Well, we can make the furnace first. Might as well just put it over here. Okay, and. I'll have to make some roofs, too. Uh, there's the rest of my iron. Be nice if I could also make carryable bags. I hate carrying capacity issues, and this one is definitely guilty of it. Required a workbench. Oh, requires a workbench. I've got to make the... i got to make the iron ingots. Okay, now we come down here. And... Anvil. Corner. Okay, cool. We're gonna need more iron, aren't we? Probably. Well, let's make all that we can, weapon-wise. Can I make an iron sword? I need a stick. 
Okay, so let's start with the Iron Sword. Iron Armor requires four plus wool. So we can at least do an Iron Sword and Shield. These guys are freaking out over here. Okay, so I'm going to get rid of all of my old equipment. Not that I necessarily need to, but... Like, we're never going to be coming back to this wooden stuff. Every tier pretty much doubles the doubles the, the damage. It's not worth holding on to it. Yeah, defense 15, defense 20. Yeah. Yeah, we don't need the we don't need these things. Let's move the iron over. Right. I was gonna make we need two more things of wooden roofs. Oh, I wonder if things would be easier if I sloped the roof properly. Okay. Like this. Maybe it'd be maybe it'd be easier to see outside if I did that. I don't know. Well, one way or another, we'll find that find out next episode. So I'll see you guys in the next uh, next episode of Feel the Snow. And as always, thanks for watching. Ah, crap! My teleportal's gone. Well, that sucked. I guess I'll have to walk back or something or. Maybe I'll put the teleport rune outside that thing. I don't I don't really know. Anyway, like I was saying, see ya.